Welcome to YouTube Celebrity Gossip News with me and Tommy. Tommy, how's it going? It is going great, Chris. We got a ghost set coming up this weekend, and we just had some rain, so it's nice and cool now. Nice. It's nice and warm here, and we haven't had any rain for the last couple days, but going to Portland to see some family um, this weekend, and uh, we're all... The big stuff is happening at two, uh, such as riots and everything, but I'm not gonna go there and report it. I'm going there to see family, like I said. But until then, guess what, Tommy? What? Chris? We have some YouTube celebrity gossip news, so what's gonna work? And here we go. Welcome back everyone. So Tommy, um, got to ask you, what's happening this week? What do you got to share? Well, YouTube just announced that they're going to be exclusively hosting the streaming awards for 2020 on December 13th this year. It also coincides with their 15th year anniversary and also this will be the 10th uh, annual streaming awards. Uh, basically what the streaming awards are, for those who don't know it is, it's uh, where they honor uh, people uh, who stream videos on YouTube in categories such as Best Creator, Best Show, and many others. Past winners have included Rhett and Link, Good Mythical Morning, Tiana uh, Mojo, as well as many others who have taken those uh, titles home with them. So they're planning on uh, airing that on the 13th of December of 2020. Nice, that's great. No, that's very, very good. They're also starting, uh, nominees are open now, and uh, you don't have to be a part of anything. It's totally free to submit, and so I suggest submit your favorite YouTubers out there for the categories that are available. You have Mr. Beast you can nominate. Uh, of course, Rhett and Link. Uh, also, another past winner was Ro Rosanna Pansini, uh, had one in the past. So, like I said, there's lots of different categories, like Best, uh, best Show, Best Creator, Best Newscast, uh, and the list goes on and on. Right, it's like your Emmys, or it's like the Movie Awards, it's like the Music Awards, but this is for YouTube, and it's really, really awesome, so that's great to hear. So, Tommy, does TMZ catch up with uh, uh, President Trump to where he wants to delay uh, the presidential election against Joe Biden and basically what he really wants to do is um, he wants to delay it by at least a couple of months until they find a vaccine because he's saying that basically it's because of um, because they haven't had a vaccine yet um, there's still the testing phases for vaccine and he also wants to also delay it just because of health and safety reasons that's why he wants to stay in the white house longer than expected to be so that's great and all but from what i know is that officially uh congress would have to do that he as president uh a president cannot officially change or extend the date uh, as far as the Constitution goes. So if he, if he could do it, uh, it would be literally impossible for him to do it just by himself. Right. He can't do it on his own. He, he would have to go through... He'd have to go through Congress. Right. Congress is, you know, big, and he would have to take the right steps. You can't just do that at the last minute and be like, okay, you know, it's also... Um, a big no-no because that's breaking the law and there's some people that think this is great that he's trying to do this I think you know it he can think he can do whatever he wants he can do but in the end uh, there are steps that have to be taken and I think that he just wants to 
skip all the steps because you like you like I said before, uh, you have to have an amendment to the Constitution in order to do that, and that takes time. It's not something that's going to take just a matter of like a week or a couple days. So it's a process that takes more than just a couple days. Right, and not only that. So Bill Bill Bear has been saying, Tommy, if you know who Bill is that um, you're going to have to drag him out of office. He's got, not going to go willingly. That he's a stubborn uh, guy. And, you know, if, you, if you're no longer uh, elected, you know, the people vote you out, you're out. It's not like it's like your own business, you know, where you can do whatever you want. This is, a, this is the presence of you of the United States. You can't just decide, okay, I'm going to stick around here as long as I can. Right, exactly. That's my thoughts exactly. And, you know, plus, uh, you know, um, you know, it's time for a new president. We'll see if we have a new president or not. Uh, I'm not going to throw my two cents in there. But uh, is that all the news that we have right now, Tommy, or is there anything else? Uh, yes. Remember back when I said, said uh, Charles Trippi was going, uh, undergoing a third brain surgery? Yes. Well, he had his third brain surgery uh, not too long ago, uh, last week, and it was very successful, as in they removed everything. And Great. So, yeah, everything got removed. Uh, he's recovering very well. Uh, him and his wife are happy. His baby's healthy, too. So everything went really well. That's very awesome that um, that Charles Trippi is recovering. And Charles Trippi, if you're watching, we wish you a happy recovery. And hope you're doing well, buddy, out there. And take care of yourself. And um, hope to see you making new things and creative videos soon. So is there anything else, Tommy? Yes. So other than maybe some radiation or some other kind of treatment, uh, from what the doctor said, he should be done with the tumor and everything for the rest of his life, unless something else pops up. But this particular one, he's done with it. Right. Well, happy thoughts, Tommy. Happy thoughts. Um, that's what the doctor said. So I guess that's all the news that we have, right, Tommy? Yep. All right. So what can people do? They can subscribe to our channels by clicking the subscribe button. They can like the video that helps YouTube know that people are watching us and puts us up where more people can see us. They can also ring that notification bell to know when we post videos. So leave a comment down on the comment area below and who do you think is going to win the presidential election this year. So everybody take care and we're out of here. See you guys next time and this has been a top level media. And stay safe out there. Bye for now. Bye.